Okay, so we are on the second problem. And it says, determine the equation of the straight line that passes the point minus 3 and minus 2 and 1 and 2. So this is our x and this is our y coordinate. This is our x and y. So this is x1, this is y1, this is x2 and this is y2. So we don't have a gradient, but we can use this formula. We can say it is uh, y2 minus y1 divided by y2 minus y1 is equal to x2 minus x1 divided by x2 minus x1. So we have it as y minus, what is y1 for me? y1 is negative 2 divided by, what is y2? y2 is what? 2 minus y1 which is what? Negative what? 2. This will be equal to uh, x minus, what is x1? x1 is what? Negative what? 3 over what? What is x2? x2 is 1 minus, what is x1? x1 is what? Negative 3. So we have it as y plus 2 over uh, 2 plus 2 is equal to x plus 3 over 1 plus 3. So we have it as y plus 2 over 2 plus 2 which is 4 is equal to x plus 3 over what? 1 plus 3 which is what? 4. Cause multiply. 4 will be into bracket y plus 2 is equal to 4 will be into bracket x plus 3. So we have it as 4y plus 8 is equal to 4x uh, plus 12. So then we have it as, if we put it in a uh, coordinate plane form, we have it as 4y will be equal to 4x plus 12 minus 8. This will go the other way. So 4y will be equal to 4x plus what? 12 minus 8 is 4. So let me divide both sides, every side by 4, because they can be divided by 4. So here I'm left with y is equal to x plus what? Plus 1. So I can say that this is the equation of the straight line that passes through this point. 